This is a home dehumidifier. This one does uh, about 4,500 square feet. They do offer in other sizes, uh, 1,500, 3,500, and one other, I think. Um, I wanted it running so you could hear how loud it is. And then it does have a turbo mode if like maybe you just got it and you wanna bring your humidity down quicker just so you can hear the difference in settings. But I'm gonna turn it off for just a second so you can hear me talking a little better. Um, with the one with the auto pump, there are three ways you can empty it. So one is you can just have it fill this tank up and it'll fill that up with water. So you just pull it out and then dump it. If you have it to that setting, when it's full, it will um, shut off. So you do have to come make sure you empty it because it will stop running once that gets full. Your other option is uh, if you get a garden hose connector, um, you can just run a garden hose off this or just buy a, pump, a hose that will spring into that. So this just screws off like this. And you can see we got some water in there. Um, so if you're not using that, then you keep this cap on. And then the other option, so my setup right now is temporary. We have the auto pump connected. I have it running into this bucket. Um, as you can see, this is about a week's worth of running. So this pulls a lot of water out of the air. Um, I've got enough hose here. I'm gonna run it up the wall and then I'm gonna have to drill through my foundation. So I just have not got to that project yet. So eventually I will never have to touch this because once the tank gets full, kicks the pump on and then kicks it out. So let's go over some of the features of how to turn this on and run it. So obviously it has a power button and then uh, you just press this and you see it lights up green. That means I'm using that pump to kick the water out. Um, the filter, it'll let you know when you need to clean the filter. It does that about every 30 days or so. You'll need to just take this out and rinse it off and then put it back in so you don't have to buy new filters. Um, continuous running means it's not even gonna look at your humidity, it's just gonna constantly run on. I like it to be able to turn off um, once, it's, once it reaches the humidity. So you can set this to whatever you want. You can see I'll turn it up and it'll just shut off because it'll already be there. So um, you can set it to whatever you want and it'll, when it'll get there, it'll turn off. And then when it gets above that humidity again, it'll kick back on. So it'll take a little bit to turn off because it has to cool itself off. But um, this is a great little unit. It's got little handles built into the sides. It weighs about 45 pounds, so it's not too bad. It also has casters, so you can wheel it around if you need to. Um, great unit, like I said, I love the pump feature. Um, you can pump it into a sink or whatever. The gravity fed one works good if you have a floor drain or if you want, I set this up on a table and I ran it into that bucket for a little bit, but works awesome.